Are you guys having trouble solving the step two error? Or are you stuck on step two of AdSense approval? At Airing Tech, we finally got monetized in January after over 20 attempts. We were stuck at step two, AdSense approval. And here's how we resolved the issue. Step one, you should only have one AdSense account. If you're applying for monetization for the first time, you may not have an AdSense account yet. But if you're unsure, search AdSense no reply at google.com or just AdSense in all your Gmail accounts. Even if you don't remember creating one, your Gmail might be linked to someone else's AdSense account through recovery emails or phone numbers. If that's the case, you need to remove those connections before proceeding. Step two, checking and managing your Google accounts. Click on your profile in your browser and select Manage your Google account. On the left, go to Payments and Subscriptions and click Manage Payment Methods. Verify your identity and navigate to Subscriptions and Services. If you see an AdSense account here, ensure it's properly linked. If you don't see anything, that's a good sign. If you've ever used Google Ad Manager, make sure to close that account as well. Step three, check for active AdSense accounts. Before closing anything, check if you have an active AdSense account. If you do, select, yes, I have an existing AdSense for YouTube or AdSense account and apply. If your old AdSense account was rejected, you'll need to close it, but wait, do not close it immediately if you just received a rejection email. Move on to step four first. To close your AdSense account, sign in to your old AdSense account. Confirm the policies and resubmit. Go to account and click on settings, select account information and click close account. Well, I had AdSense for my website and later tried setting it up for YouTube too. But since I thought my website application was rejected, I assumed I didn't have an account. Turns out that might've been one of the reasons I got rejected in the first place. Also, Remember to close your payment profile in your browser, tap on your profile and click manage your Google account. On the left side, tap payments and subscriptions and select manage payment methods. Verify your identity, then go to subscriptions and services. Here you can check the canceled subscriptions. Now go to the settings, scroll down all the way to the end and click on close payments profile. Verify account and here select the reason why you wanna close the account. Click Continue, and finally, click Close Payments Profile. Step four, patience is key. As I said, I had an AdSense account and still applied, so I got rejected. As soon as I got the rejection email from AdSense, I jumped on YouTube, watched tutorials, and followed the steps to close my account. But in YouTube Studio, nothing updated. I noticed it. But honestly, I was too stressed about the rejection to wait for it to change to the error message. It was still showing in progress. And in the Earn tab, I wasn't getting the two usual options. Fix in AdSense for YouTube and change association. So I reached out to YouTube support. They usually start by creating a ticket, asking for your channel ID and AdSense pub ID. At first, they promised to help. But after waiting for five to 10 minutes, they just repeat the same thing. Check YouTube Studio and read the same articles I'd already seen. Then they mentioned my account was already associated with AdSense. Maybe it was because my channel Gmail and AdSense Gmail were the same. This time, a supervisor confirmed that even before I applied, my channel was already connected to this AdSense account. Since I had closed the payment profile, I had to wait 21 days for the system to refresh. They told me to wait a bit, and after a few hours, I finally got the option to change association. So I created a brand new Gmail account, applied again, and still got rejected. When I contacted support again, they repeated that my AdSense was already linked and that I needed to wait 21 days for the issue to resolve. I waited 21 days, created a new payment profile, and reapplied. But since it was already rejected before, they rejected it again. This time, I waited for YouTube to refresh and show the error message before doing anything. Once that happened, I closed the account again and wanted to reapply. But then I thought, let me ask them first. That's when I learned that you can only change your linked AdSense for YouTube account once every 32 days. Luckily, it had already been almost 30 days and I had already tried multiple times with different accounts. 
So I waited two more days, reapplied, and got rejected again. But this time, I figured something out. After the system refresh, if I applied again, I wouldn't have to wait 32 days again. I confirmed this with YouTube chat support. By the way, YouTube chat support is available to anyone with 500 plus subscribers. Step five, the final steps to get approved. Here's the trick that finally worked for me. Create a completely new Gmail account with a random name, or your own, if you prefer. Go to YouTube Studio under the Earn tab and click on Change Association. Select, no, I don't have an existing account, and sign in with the new Gmail account you just created. Fill out the country and other information, agree to the terms, and click Set Up Account. Enter your name and address. Use the same name as your Gmail account for now. This can be changed later after approval. Use a different address than before, preferably one with a verifiable ZIP code from a major city. Don't worry. After approval, you can change your payment details. Go to AdSense and click on Payments and select Payment Info. Scroll to Manage Settings and update your name and address. Step six, link your Gmail with your YouTube account. The main step, once you've applied, link your new Gmail account to your YouTube channel. Go to YouTube Settings, click Permissions, invite your new Gmail account as a manager. Step seven, optional, add your tax information. This step isn't always required, but if AdSense asks for it, you can enter your tax details under Payments Info. I hope these steps help you get approved for AdSense and finally monetize your YouTube channel. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. See you in the next one.